Hello Compose Enthusiast, today let's explore the world of Crossfade animation in Jetpack Compose. Crossfade is all about making transitions between different stuff in your app super smooth. It's like a cool trick that makes your app look really nice. To get a feel for Crossfade, think of it like a magic flip of a credit card. We will make it show its front and back side just by tapping a button. It's a simple way to make things look fancy. Now let's jump into Android Studio together to make this happen. So here let's first create a new file. Here let's take a box layout. So here in this box layout, we will take a button and with the help of that button, we will flip the card image. So first let's paste our images here in this drawable package. So we will use these two images. So here let's create one composable function. So we will use this composable function for our credit card. But we need this composable function in our crossfade file. So let's cut from here and paste it here. So here we have this crossfade composable function and it needs this target state. So what I will do, I will create an enum class so here let's create an enum class with the name credit card position. So here in this enum we will we will use two type front and back. So here let's first create a state with the help of that remember. So in this state, we will keep the front as the default state. So here let's pass our state as the target state. So in this crossfade, we can use this target state with the help of when block. So here let's press Alt Enter and add remaining branches. So here we have. But this crossfade is giving us warning. So let's add this label parameter. So when our target state will be front, so we will use composable for front credit card. So here we can use our credit card and this needs the image resource ID. So let's use r dot drawable dot card front. And let's copy this and here when the state will be back so here we will provide the back card and next thing how this state will be changed so here after this crossfade we will use a button and for the button content let's use text composable And let's also align our button in the bottom center. And on this button on click, we will update our state with the help of when block. So when our card position will be front, so we will change it to back. And when our card position will be back, so we will change it to the front. So here is our code. So let's use this composable function in our main activity and run our app. So 
so here is our app so let's press this button so we can see we have a good crossfade effect in switching these two composables so this crossfade animation is quite helpful in cases where you need to switch between two contents so this is all for this video in the next video we will look into that animated content thanks for watching